If you are in the UK, you can't really get away from Nestle. 98% um, of consumers will consume a Nestle product of some kind uh, every single day, and you will find us in, in every single outlet possible. And uh, that's my um, role as the supply chain director. Uh, supply chain means different things to different people. So to give you the context of what supply chain means uh, in the UK, uh, my team and I were responsible for everything, as I describe it, from the farm to the fork. We were seen at that time in December 2011 as best in class. So on the one hand, I had this fantastically high-performing team. Okay. On the other hand, I had two pressures going on. I had a, a boss, a CEO, who is a real change agent. So I had that tension of a, a real push for change from a CEO, uh, yet measuring that against an organization that was fantastically performing and therefore I had no obvious, we would call it in English, burning platform. So there was no real crisis that said um, I needed to change anything. I did have a strong feeling that doing nothing was not an option because if I did nothing then in two to three years time I was pretty confident that the competition would have overtaken us or at least if not caught us up. In the month of um, June, we got an award from Nestle head office in Switzerland for being the best performing supply chain in, in the zone, uh, in zone Europe. Now that was right at the peak of making this change.